Kimberly Gibbs with Ion LP, and I have Mr. Adam Smith with Bilobal Holdings. How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Good, thank you for speaking with me. Now, there have been some articles about Bitcoin, and I know you know a lot about that. Can you let me know what it is and exactly how it works? Bitcoin is a cryptocurrency, mm -hmm. which means that it's nothing physical. It's actually, the way it exists is in a shared key, and it's a 256-linked key, um, alphanumeric, that unlocks an encryption bit and um, in a public database. There's been some discussion about how secure is a Bitcoin. Is it secure? Is it not secure? Can you elaborate on that, please? Yeah, you, you've probably seen some stories in the news where some websites have gotten hacked. But it's, it's important to understand Bitcoin fundamentally is very secure. Right. And it's just like money. If you leave your numbers and letters laying around, someone can take it exactly. and it's gone forever. So what a lot of people have done is they've, they've wanted to store these in the cloud. Well, you do, definitely do not want to do that with your money <laughs> right. um, because once a Bitcoin is is gone, it is gone. The way that a Bitcoin should be handled is it should be downloaded to a physical device that you have, um, so it's on the device, it's not accessible from the internet, mm -hmm. and it's password protected. So in order for someone to steal your Bitcoins, they have to take your physical device and they have to know your password. Right. So in that aspect, it's very secure. And the great thing for retailers is if, if this technology was to be widely adopted by consumers, is that there are no swipe fees. Uh, there's no data breach concerns because it all goes through the Bitcoin network that is, that is highly secure because it's actually because it's out in the open mm -hmm. and it's not in a, in a trusted network. Thank you so much for explaining that. Kimberly Gibbs with Ion LP.